Hello, I'm Jovan Johnson. Finance Minister Dr. Nigel Clark says the personal income tax threshold will be increased to $1.7 million from $1.5 million. It will cost government $9 billion and will take effect in April. And Dr. Clark has announced a $20,000 tax refund to taxpayers who earn under $3 million annually. And the Finance Minister says evidence gathered in the FinSAC Commission of Inquiry, which probed the 1990s financial crisis, will be made public. A date wasn't given. The Commission of Inquiry was set up in 2009, but there has been no final report. The probe has cost $150 million. The People's National Party's Andrew Swaby was today sworn in as Mayor of Kingston. The JLP's Delroy Williams, who held the top post for the last eight years, is the new Deputy Mayor. Meanwhile, the police said a clash between party supporters broke out at the event after PNP supporters reportedly blocked the view of JLP supporters to a televised broadcast. Four members of a family died in a suspected case of arson at their home in a section of Central Village known as Compound early Tuesday morning. They have been identified as Nicola Clark and her two daughters, 13-year-old Sora White and Nicola James and Miss James's four-year-old son, Caden Patterson. In sports, Jamaica were crowned Women's Super 50 Cup champions with a game to spare when they pulled off an edgy three-wicket victory over Windward Islands in the penultimate round on Monday. In your currency trading today, one US dollar was being sold for $155.55, the British pound sterling for $197.02, and the Canadian dollar for $115.10. In your weather forecast, on Wednesday morning, there will be partly cloudy skies and windy conditions across northern parishes, otherwise mostly sunny. In the afternoon, expected to be mostly sunny with windy conditions across northern parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. Remember to follow us on X, formerly Twitter, Facebook and Instagram, and like, comment and share on YouTube. I'm Joven Johnson.